Well, the family of Ronald Green, the black man who died while in the custody of Louisiana State Police back in 2019, was joined by civil rights activist and attorney Ben Crump in calling for civil rights charges for the officers involved in Green's death. Well, NBC Local 33 Sydney Simone is live at the federal courthouse with details for us tonight. Hey, Sydney. Good evening, Jacob, Renee. Well, earlier today, a press conference was held on the steps of the state capitol where Ben Crump and both families are asking the officers in the death of Ronald Green to be charged the same as the officers in the death of Tyree Nichols. Crump says although Nichols and Green's deaths and cases are two separate things, they are eerily the same and similar. Five white police officers are accused of beating, tasing, and dragging Green while in ankle shackles by who was the in 2019 after a high speed chase. Nichols, who was stopped for an alleged traffic violation, died of blows to the head when he was beaten by members of the Memphis Police Department. Five black police officers are charged with second degree murder in that case. In 20 days, my son, in 20 days, those five black police officers who brutally killed Tyree Nichols on video were terminated charged and arrested for murder because when you have evidence of a crime on video even ray charles can see what happened so it was drastically different with ronald green and we're here to ask america why is that with my son ronald green three and a half years we had these indictments very weak indictments very weak The civil rights leader believes the consequences the officers received for killing Tyree Nichols should be the blueprint across the nation. And officers involved in the arrest of Ronald Green have faced charges on a state level ranging from negligent homicide to malfeasance. The families are asking for federal charges now. Reporting live downtown, Sydney Simone, NBC Local 33 News. All right, Sydney, thank you for that live report for us tonight.